Should you claim PIP? Do you have a health condition or disability and need help with day-to-day activities or getting from A to B? If so, you might be entitled to a personal independence payment, also known as PIP. You can get PIP whether you're in work or unemployed, rich or poor, live with others or by yourself. The amount of PIP you get depends how your condition affects your ability to complete 10 daily living activities and two mobility activities. Daily living includes cooking, eating, medication and therapy, getting dressed, using the toilet and washing and bathing. It also includes talking to people, reading, meeting people face to face and managing your money. If you need help with even one or two of these activities, you might be awarded the daily living component. Mobility includes planning and following journeys, which is relevant if you need help getting around outside due to your mental health, learning disability or sensory needs. Mobility also includes moving around, which is about how far you can walk and is relevant if you have physical difficulties walking. If you need help with either of these activities, you might be awarded the mobility component. Have a think about the help you need. You might need an aid or appliance, someone to encourage or remind you, someone to help you stay safe, or someone to physically help you do the activity. PIP is about the help you need, not the help you get. So even if you don't get help at the moment, you could still get an award. Remember, PIP is for both mental and physical conditions. Almost any health condition, sensory need, or disability might be relevant. Your condition doesn't even need to be diagnosed. What matters is how your condition affects you and the help you need to get by in your day-to-day life. You need to be between 16 and state pension age the first time you claim. Otherwise, you might need to claim DLA or attendance allowance instead. An award of PIP can make a big difference. The money helps cover some of the extra costs of having a health condition or disability and it can also entitle you to increases in your other benefits and extra support in other areas of life as well. This has been just a snapshot of what you need to know to make a successful PIP claim. Check out our other videos, the Benefits and Works website and our e-learning modules for a wealth of information and resources on PIP.